All right, so today we are talking about celestite. And just a word of warning, you're, you're going to want to get used to hearing probably every video I'm going to say this is one of my favorite crystals. And I hate to say it, celestite is definitely one of my favorite crystals. This stone is a very high vibrational stone and it works perfectly with the third eye and the crown chakras and this stone if i had to pick one main topic when you're talking about celestite it would be for me sleep and i'm not saying this is gonna help you sleep. I know that sounds strange, but this stone is going to be perfect for using when you are about to sleep or during your sleep. And I will explain all that in a minute. So look at this beautiful crystal, and it is just a pale blue. It's, it's between like a blue and a white spectrum just a beautiful pale color, just gorgeous crystals. And you could get these relatively cheap, depending on the size, of course, it could get a little pricey, but celestite, when you're working with it, you're gonna, you're gonna wanna cleanse this crystal and you're also gonna wanna activate it. And I will have, if I don't already, I will have videos on both of those topics. And when I say this is a crystal all about sleep, I really mean it's going to be so easy for you to use. A lot of crystals, look at this one. Oh, man. Look at the crystals on this. And I could show you, I'm, I plan on showing you a bunch of these from my personal collection. But um, look at this guy. This is one of my favorites from my personal collection. But... When I say this is going to be an easy to use stone for when you go to sleep, that's exactly what I mean. And you don't have to go into any crazy deep meditative states and, and uh, do all kinds of crazy stuff. This is as easy to use as either placing it under your pillow, putting it in a charm bag, holding it, laying it on your forehead, right at your third eye. It, it just being with it during the night is going to activate this crystal and allow it to do what it needs to do. And the cool part, just having it with you while you're sleeping is pretty much enough. Now, a lot of crystals, there's two ways. There's passive and active when you're using crystals. Passive means you could just sleep with it. You could hold it. You could lay it on your, your body in some form. You could hold it in your hand. Active is more of when you're kind of imbuing it with more of an intention. So with celestite, you really don't need to do much. You just need to hold it. So it's a very passive stone, very passive crystal to get it to work. And the cool part of celestite is it's going to give you crazy dreams. And crazy is good because this crystal, like I said in the beginning of the video, it's a very high vibrational crystal. This is going to connect you with the higher realms. And when I say the higher realms, I mean the angelic realms, the to your spirit guides, uh, high frequency beings, um, beings that are way above the earthly plane. And when you connect with these awesome beings, in your sleep is primarily the best way to go about it because they're going to communicate with you through dreams. And when they commun communicate with you during dreams, they're going to give you imagery. They're going to give you all kinds of cool stuff. And what I would recommend is get yourself a dream guide. 
and definitely work with this crystal during the night. And you are going to see really good results. And I could tell you a bunch of stories, uh, maybe in the comments or something, but this, this crystal, I'm not saying it's going to put you out like a light. I keep referencing sleep, sleep, sleep. <laughs> I'm not going to say it's going to make you fall asleep and you're going to sleep like a baby. If anything, there is a chance that this could keep you awake. This has a high vibration, a high energy output. It's going to give you a lot of that energy you need for these beings to communicate with you uh, during your sleep. And it might not be the best to get a good night's sleep, but it's going to definitely give you an awesome dream recall. It's going to really work with you on those deeper levels throughout the night. And that's why as soon as you wake up, jot everything down because it could be gone in a blink. And then you could at least take that information, look it up in your dream guide or online, see kind of what the symbolism means. Uh, you know, you could be flying on a hawk down over a creek. Uh, who knows what you're going to be doing in these dreams. But this way, you could at least uh, have some reference to figuring out what these beings are trying to communicate with you in your in your earthly life. So, very easy stone to use. Very, very easy. Just simply holding it while you're sleeping is going to do the, do the job. And I love this crystal because of that. <clears throat> Just because of its ease of use. Um... Let me show you some of my other specimens here, too, because I am just in love with some of these. Let me show you this guy. Look at that. Woo! Look at this beauty. That is just... It, it's got to be one of my favorite celestite crystals, uh, clusters that I do have. Um, there's one more after this I'll show you, but look at this. Look at the beauty on this thing. I mean absolutely incredible look at this crystal on the top here just beautiful pale blue crystals on this oh and this is probably one of my largest celestite specimens i have and i do have a bunch of them but this is probably my favorite to be honest with you and i have this on a on a shelf i work with this once in a while um, I try to work with all my crystals. It's just, it's tough because I have so many crystals. Um, let me show you my other one here. Actually, there's two more. This guy is a, and I need two hands for this. This is a celestite geode. And it's kind of hard to see in there, but this goes in there pretty deep. And it's got some weight to it. Just a beauty. Absolutely beautiful specimen. Another one of my favorites from my personal collection. Look at that. Whew. And we're going to go with one more I'm going to show you here. And if this one, this one might be my favorite. I don't know. It's so hard. Look at this guy. And this is kind of, this is a geode. Look at the crystals inside of here. They're like teeth coming out just incredible and i just love celestite i love looking at it i love working with it and again this is all from my personal experience my personal preferences i like using celestite because it's easy to use you don't have to do anything crazy and you're going to get results you're going to sleep with this and you could have results in the very first night and there's other crystals that can also do the same with dream recall and, and, uh, but this guy is going to really connect you with those higher realms and those higher beings, which will assist you in whatever you need. But look at this. Oh God, just a beautiful, beautiful celestite geode. So anything else I'm missing? I'm sure I can, I mean, I could talk about celestite for probably another 15 minutes. <laughs> and show you more but i'm gonna wrap it up and let it be there so i hope you guys enjoyed looking at some of these specimens and keep in mind too 
I also do sell crystal specimens. Um, I have an Etsy shop and I'll put that that link in the description as well. It's our, it's also on my banner if you click on it. But um, I don't know if I have any current celestite specimens for sale, but I'm always changing, always have different things. So make sure you check that out. So that'll do it for celestite. And next time we'll talk about something else. And this is just, whew, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't. It's like, it's like candy. Look at this. Oh, I love it. All right, everybody. We will talk to you next time. Hope you enjoyed the video. Bye-bye.